This year, Northampton High School started using reusable plastic plates in an attempt to be more environmentally conscious. Two weeks ago, over 60 of the cafeteria's plates were found by one of the custodians buried in the woods behind the school. The cafeteria had already noticed their supplies were dropping rapidly, but they were disappointed by the discovery of the buried plates. Both custodians and cafeteria staff had to work extra hard to dig up the plates and wash them off. We spoke to some of the students and staff to learn more about this incident and how to prevent it from happening again. My opinion on the plates being added, I think it's fine. I don't sort of have, I don't really have a strong opinion on it. But I think it's a good addition rather than disposable plates. I think it's very cool that the plates were added to the school because like it relies on a source instead of like disposable trays to dirty the environment. It's a reusable source instead of throwing stuff in the dump and destroying the environment. Yes, I do think the school should be more green. I think everything in general should be working towards that and including our school. The plates being buried, it's school property. So if, if a student is the one burying them, that's really not okay because it's not their property to bury. It's like taking something away from someone just to like hide it somewhere and not use it properly. I feel like just put out an announcement that someone did try to bury them and it is school property and it's theirs and it's their money. I was honestly kind of disappointed that no one had mentioned that they were out there because it had to have been a while because there were so many plates. Like we come in here every day trying to do a good job for you and to have somebody do that and make our job initially harder and that's just very disrespectful. It got really hard because we were running out of plates a lot sooner than usual so we would always have to go back washing dishes, being short-handed on the line or on the register. It made us short-handed a lot of times. We have many different places for bins. There's one out in the hallway, there's one by the door, there was one outside the door and our main window. So not only would somebody have to be running to hit all of those spots to make sure that there's dishes there to wash, so it really cut off our time being able to serve food. So my initial reaction was that I was shocked um, and I actually felt kind of sad and disappointed for both the other students and the food service staff. How to prevent this? I'm quite unsure on that. I feel like we put adequate bins out in all sorts of areas of the cafeteria, outside near the entrances, near the dish room. Um, I'm just hoping maybe through advocacy and letting everyone know um, that would be the best prevention. Um, I shared with Ms. Valancourt and so I believe from there she has shared with other student groups, so kind of just getting the word out of how important it is to bring the plates back and so that we can wash them to reuse them for the next meals. The cafeteria staff and head of food services have been working hard to make the cafeteria more environmentally conscious, so please make sure to follow their requests and return the plates when you're done eating. Thanks so much for watching. See you next week.